Hi folks and welcome back to the channel. Hey, I'm Ron with Ideal Industries. In this video, I want to share with you one of my favorite, more versatile tools we have actually at Ideal Industries, and that's our 35-688, what we call our 21-in-1 twist nut screwdriver. And it is just one screwdriver in a line of twist nut screwdrivers we have now at Ideal. So go check out our website if you'd like to learn more and how you go about getting one of these things in your hands. And, you know, this is a combination screwdrivers, and they've been around actually for quite a while. And I think when you get this one in your hand and compare it to the other ones you might have in the pouch, you're going to find out that they don't stand up to this one. My contractor buddies that have one of these things absolutely love them. And I'm telling you, it's a type of screwdriver. If you hand it to a guy on a job site and loan it to him and he walks away with it, the odds of you getting it back aren't real good. <laughs> and when you pick one up for the first time, they just feel really good in the hand. It's nicely balanced. And one neat thing about this screwdriver is when you look at the handle itself and you compare it to a conventional screwdriver handle, it's actually quite a bit longer. And what that allows me to do is get that all the way across the length of the palm of my hand. So when I be able to wrap my hand around, I got a lot of surface area there and hopefully I can apply quite a bit of torque. Now there are torsion bars along the handle here as well. And they're like little ridges. And again, that allows us to apply quite a bit of torque to the screwdriver. Now, matter of fact, it's rated for 225 pounds, and if you can get anywhere close to that, you're somewhat of a gorilla, okay? Now, the handle itself here has got a, a textured Santa Prim grip to it, and it's impervious to oil and grease and all that kind of good stuff. So hopefully it'll give you a nice non-slip surface as you're actually out there working with it in the field. The wire connector wrench in the top of the tool will accept a large variety of different wire connectors and will allow you to get a good grip on those wing nuts and wire nuts so you can get a nice twist in your conductors, ensuring that you have a really good connection. Now the middle of the tool here has a heavy duty ratchet mechanism to it designed really for the pro and it's a double action twin tooth design that's gonna ensure you can smoke your buddies in the time it actually takes to tighten and loosen those fasteners. The name 21 in one suggests the tool will do 21 things. First is the wire connector wrench and when you remove the wire connector wrench in the top of the tool, you will find multiple bits stored inside, which should cover most of the fasteners you're going to run across. There is a number one Phillips and a 3 16 slotted bit, a number one and number two square shank bit, number 15, 20, 25, and 30 star bits, and 3 30 seconds, 1 8th, 3 16 and 5 30, sec 30 seconds hex bits, all conveniently stored in the handle of the screwdriver. In the front of the tool, you'll find a number two and number three Phillips bit, plus a quarter and five sixteenths inch slotted bit. There is also a quarter inch, five sixteenths inch, and seven sixteenths inch nut driver built into the tool as well. And the tool has a convenient wire looping holes built into the handles to make a perfect loop on your conductors every time when installing wiring devices. A conduit deburring tool can be installed in the screwdriver as well, and will deburr the inside and outside of half inch, three quarter, and one inch thin wall conduit. Now, when you finally get one of these in your hands, you're going to find out it's a premium screwdriver. It's going to last you actually quite a long time. And it's going to do everything you could ask a screwdriver to do except for actually tighten those screws. Hey, thanks for coming, folks. I appreciate it. I'm Ron with Ideal, and I'll see you on the next one.